Hi there, this is Form 2 Financial Accounting and today we are taking on manufacturing account. Yes, manufacturing account. Now that word is very interesting. I had a friend who was nicknamed uh, manufacturing because he was always making fun about the manu, the fuck and the train. Okay, so that is what we are going to take on today. Now let's look at our lesson objectives. By the end of the lesson, we should be able to define manufacturing account. We should be able to state the classification of costs. So the various classes of cost. And then we should be able to also know the formats for the manufacturing and trading profit and loss account. Now the third um, objective will take us to the final account of these manufacturing firms. However, let's know what manufacturing account is. So, first of all, the word manufacturing means to transform. What are you transforming? Raw materials into what? Finished product or semi-finished product. Okay? So any firm that participates or takes on transforming raw materials into finished or semi-finished product could be called a manufacturing firm. So I have it here that manufacturing firms are firms that use components, parts, or raw materials to make finished or semi-finished product. So they transform raw materials into finished and semi-finished product. Semi-finished because it has not finished the production process. Okay, good. Now in Ghana, we have so many manufacturing firms. Yes, of course, if we go to the industrial area, specifically Tema for that matter, you will see a lot of these firms who transform raw materials into finished product. And so I have your example. The first one you, you have is Unilever Ghana. And I know you've heard of this company. They produce a lot of soap. Key soap is a typical example of one of their products. Omo, Sunlight, Lux, Geisha, etc. I'm sure you use some of these soaps uh, in the home. Now what happens is that that final product you see as soap, Geisha, was manufactured from a certain raw material. 